In today's video, I'm going to open up 35 exclusive crates. Let's see how many 1% units we could get. Let's get right into this. All right, guys. So look at this. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rows of all crates. Plus this one down here. So that makes 36 crates in total. What do you say we jump right into this and open them up? So here we go. Number one is a scientist cameraman. But before we get into the next one, what do you guys say we give one of you lucky viewers an actual crate here? So we're going to gift one out to one lucky person. The winner's going to be popping up on the screen right now. And then, of course, we'll give them the crate. All right. So shout out to Axel one more time. Here is your free crate. I really hope you get the like really good item. It's super hard to get, but hey, I believe in you. Hopefully I can get it in this video as well. So there you go, man. And open that up. Let me know what you get. Now that that giveaway is over, what do you guys say we give away another crate? Let's set the goal for 165,000 subscribers. Let's see how fast we can hit that goal and then we'll give this awesome crate away. All you got to do to enter is leave a like on this video, leave a comment with your Roblox username, and of course, smash that subscribe button. The sooner we hit the goal, the sooner we give it away. Now let's get back to the video. Now guys, what do you say we go ahead and open up the rest of these crates that we have here? We really, 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 really need to get the 1% item in this video because I want to test it out. So here we go, guys. Oh, there we go. We're out to a little bit better start. Large scientist cameraman. That's something a little bit better. Shout out to boys and I show speed. They're in my server right now. Now let's get to the next one here. Scientist cameraman. Come on, guys. Give us something good. Also, I saved up 20k coins to open up some more like units in the other summon machine. And that's going to be for the new update if anything like else comes to the game. So I'm pretty excited about that. Hopefully something that, you know, we could get and it's pretty cool and like good at the game. I'm, you know, looking forward to the next update. I think it comes out tomorrow or the next day. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. It's going to be really fun. But so far we opened up like five crates, still nothing. Let's get on to the next one. And still science is cameraman every single time. Now listen guys, if, you know, if there's ever like trading in this game, I'll of course send you guys some of these extra units that we have. Like check this out. We have a lot of exclusive ones, so just let me know your username in the comments, and like later on in the future when you know we can actually. Yo, wait, hold up. Sorry, guys, I got distracted. We actually got it. No way. In the future, though, what I was trying to say is we get you guys some of these extra units that I don't really need. But yo, we actually got it. I can't believe that. You guys don't understand how many of these I open. I literally open about 50 of these crates. Yeah, you heard that right. So shout out to the guys who gifted some of these to me today. On my stream if you guys don't know i stream every single day and a lot of these crates were gifted to me so shout out to like i think your name was in shyable shyable something like that i appreciate you man we had uh deer i think that was your actual roblox username and then uh ronzo gifted me some happy queen and a few other guys as well thank you guys for that you know who you are absolute legends get a big lt in the chat for these guys if you're a member to my channel thank you so much because you actually helped me get the engineer cameraman that's awesome now we have all these extra crates. I might save them. I honestly might save them because then I could give them away when we could start trading. Isn't that a good idea? Should I just save them? I don't know. I think we save them, guys. Because I already got the unit, so why keep opening them when I could just give them away? That's what we'll do. I'm going to save them. We found out it only takes about 10 there in today's video. Let's just save them and go test this guy out. Come here, guys. Let's go jump into a game real quick. And then, uh, you know, I'll meet you guys. We'll cut right to when we're in the game. And we'll go see if we can win at Toilet HQ with the new unit. All right. So let's squad up and get in there. All right, guys. So we just spawned in. We got a few of our subscribers in the match here. We got Boy. We got Morph. I have Toby and I show Speed. So they're going to be pretty shocked when I place this down. Check this out, guys. I actually don't think that we need to put it in any certain spot. I might just put it right here. I don't know if, one, if it gets stunned, if that actually matters, but I'm going to put it right there. I've, you know, never used this troop before, so we're surely going to find out here pretty soon. So that could be another unit that, like, eats a stun for us. So that might be good, or it might actually just not work out at all. But let me tell these guys I actually got it. Check out my unit. Hopefully they, uh, they notice, because I've been telling these guys all the time in my streams that I've been really trying to get this unit, and we finally got it. So... That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Yep. Engineer boy. We finally got it. I hope that it's going to be really good. It's got 400 HP right off the rip. So that's pretty good. And we'll see how, you know, much damage it actually does when we get like the tank and stuff. So I'm pretty excited here. I don't know how long it, it takes like 30 seconds to spawn. So it's just like the heli. That's pretty good. Okay. It's not bad. I think we get like four of them down. So that's kind of nice. And that'll be like a lot of tanks. And then I'll focus on my, you know, my, these guys right here, whatever they call the jetpack guys. Those will do a lot of work. And yep, Toby, I got it. Yes, I did. Yep. 
I actually got it. I was lucky enough to do it. And I didn't have to spend a lot of my crates. So that's pretty exciting. I'm glad. And, you know, now we can give those away when we actually have trading in the game. That's going to be really, really fun. So pretty excited to, uh, you know, be able to do that. That's really good for you guys. I would love to be able to, you know, give some of these guys some of these crates. It would be really, really nice. We could do, like, little rewards where, like, maybe if we won a game, we could give away a crate. I don't know. Cool stuff like that. The other day, we did, like, a Kahoot on my stream. It was, like, a Kahoot about my life. It was kind of funny. And we gave, like, the winner, like, a, you know, well, he got friended and we, like, played with him in that game. So, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Now, we could upgrade him, actually, one more time here. So, let's do that. I'll just focus on upgrading him and then we'll be good. Yeah, so these guys are talking about the infected units, something about the leaks. I'll actually probably make like a separate video on all the new leaks coming to the game in like the next like episode 57 part two. That's gonna be pretty cool. You know, it's always nice to have like new things coming to the game. So pretty exciting stuff going on there. And now these guys should have like 800 health, right? Yeah, this one has 800. So that's really good. I don't know how many times it actually takes to like fully upgrade them. I, like I said, I've never had them before, so we're all going to figure this out together here. Pretty cool. They will just infect mythicals. Oh, that would suck, dude, if they infected mythicals, the new ones. Probably only mythics, too. Maybe, man. That's not, like, a, a bad theory right there, to be honest with you. Luckily, my guys right now so far have some decent units down. We got... Uh, oh, that's just his outfit. I was wondering, like, that... I've never seen that unit before, but no. That's just Toby. All right, we got a ninja cameraman. We have a ninja cameraman here and a jetpack guy. Now, there's one guy that's not placed anything down. I don't know who that is. It might be Toby because he's on mobile, he said. So he's going to maybe rejoin and join back. That would uh, hopefully fix the problem. Hopefully, he's able to get back in. I know Talantric added like a system where you basically could rejoin after five minutes of being disconnected. And then you could, uh, you know, get back into the game just in case you get kicked out for whatever reason. Now, also, what's pretty cool is because all these guys are my friends. We get like a big coin boost. So if we end up winning this game, guys... We're going to get a lot of extra stuff. So I'm actually pretty excited about that. And hope we end up winning. It's not going to be easy. I just hope that, you know, you guys, you know, know what units to place down. I know Boy right here, this guy, I've won with him like two times already. So he's uh, he's a pretty good teammate. I've never, I mean, I played with these guys a few times. Never Toby. Toby's one of my new members. So shout out to Toby. If you guys would like to become a member in like the bottom of my channel, there should be like a join button. Like if you're on like my homepage. You just click that and you guys can become a member. You get a few different perks. Number one, I'll friend you on Roblox. Just let me know that you became a member. If you do it on stream, then I'll get the live notification, of course. You get a special role in my Discord server. If you're not already in my Discord server, make sure that you join that. The uh, link will be in the description of this video. So make sure you guys join my Discord server. And then also a few other things like your name will be green in my streams. You get badges, emotes, all that great stuff. And I appreciate it a lot. It allows me to be able to do what I love every single day. So thank you so much to those of you guys. I really, really do appreciate that. And there was also someone on my last uh, stream. Someone left like a super thanks. It's a pretty like unknown feature on YouTube. But basically like what they did was you could leave like a comment on a YouTube video. I just found out about this actually a few days ago because of this happened. But he left a comment on my YouTube video where basically it's like a super chat on a stream. But it's like a super thanks. So you pay like, I don't know, you paid like $2 and he left like a highlighted message on my stream or on my video. I've never seen that before. It was pretty cool. I think it was William. So William, if you're, you know, watching this video, thank you so much for doing that, man. I appreciate that. You're like the first person to uh, ever do that. So shout out to you. What a legend. Now, also, guys, we got a boss toilet here. It's got 80,000 health. I'm not too worried here because I got my like, you know, guys down here. So that's good. But a little scary, a little scary. They might... Uh, Take a while here. The ally health is going to go up way up in my next upgrade. So we'll get that going pretty soon. I think they have like 1,200 now. Or is it still 800? 1,500. Wow. So that's way better than the helicopter guy. That's for sure. Now, we really got to start doing some extra damage here. Uh-oh. I think we'll be okay. Yep. We're fine. We're fine. We're good. Can you place uh, jetpacks? We just barely got it. I got engineer. I got engineer. We're good. We are good. I think we are good. I can't spell, though. I spelled good with an I in the middle. Oh, boy. I'm still learning how to spell, guys. That's my bad. All right. Here we go, though. We got some spider toilets. We got glasses toilets. This could be a little bit more hectic. I'm not sure. I think we'll be okay because we got our jetpack guy. He's level three already, so he's doing 2K damage at each time. And then my guys are going to be coming in here, and we're going to upgrade our guy one more time. So now every 24 seconds, we get another upgrade going, which is really, really good. 
and then a thousand dollars more and we'll have some even more crazy stuff what do you say we get some scientist cameramen down though that will help with stuns and you know also just tank like you know the buzz side guy whatever comes by us we'll be able to like clutch it up your sister has a hermit crab i haven't had one of those in years pretty crazy pretty crazy it's cool all right though there we go we got our whole line of troops right there so that's good when you went to the beach yeah they used to sell them at the beach all the time i remember that i've been to the beach in a while but they sure used to have them all the time uh oh guys the toilet's getting a little bit bigger now it's got six thousand health so that's really good now we just need a little bit more money and then we could get some more guys going i could place like another engineer down but i'm not gonna do that just yet i don't think that's gonna be the right move I'm going to be more like the support role this game. I'm going to have my engineers and I'm going to go for my medics right away. That way my teammates are able to just keep on attacking. It looks like we got a lot of scientists guys down though. This is pretty crazy. This is insane. So here we go. And the DJ to it. So I don't think we fought this enemy yet during this match. They got 5,000 health. But with these jetpack guys, basically they get one hit. So no big deal at all. And then look at this guys. We can upgrade our guy again. And then we just need to get him to $4,000 and we can max him out. And then he's going to have 30,000 health. So I think when you get the Titan guy, you actually only have 15,000. Toby asked if I'm recording. Let's say, sure am. All right. Let's see here. 4,000 H, not HP, dollars. And then we get the upgrade. So that's not too, too bad. Holy scientist. Yeah, we got a lot of scientists. We got a lot of scientists. Look at this. This is a whole line. Basically a whole army of scientists, guys. Oh, here we go. We got our cameraman coming in. These aren't the good ones yet. The good ones are still back here, I think. They're still taking a little while to get through. Or do we... Yeah, we got one good one. There he is right there. He's uh, taking his merry old time. Oh, we got assassin toilets coming after us, though. But we're okay. We're just fine. We're just fine. Now we got some boss toilets. They got 100k HP. Still shouldn't be too, too big of a deal. I'm not like, entirely worried just yet. But I just hope we do enough DPS here. I don't know if we're going to be able to. I feel like we're not having enough uh, strong troops down, guys. I might have to place one of these guys just for now to help out because I'm getting a little nervous here. I'm not going to lie. We don't have uh, that many good troops yet, to be honest with you. We need more jetpacks. We definitely need more jetpacks, guys. And then we'll be okay. Then we'll be okay. I'm watching every stream I show speed. Yo, you're a legend for that. I think I have to go to a family party. Oh, no, boy. Hopefully not right now. I might ask to stay home. We'll just give him an LOL in the chat. That's kind of funny. Staying home to play some tower defense here and toilet tower defense with me and the rest of the guys so here we go though one more toilet left i think that my troops are doing a lot of damage when they like run into them which is kind of nice i know that when we get the tank it's going to be even more and i'm pretty excited about that i just hope that i'm going to be able to save up for the tank unfortunately i bought this jetpack guy which wasted a lot of money but i just kind of feel like i had to there because it was getting a little risky lt being casual with it cracks me up it's kind of funny all right though here we go camera toilet i think he's talking about the cinnamon man all right though every time i see someone like one of my teammates place down the uh cinnamon guy i always call it the cinnamon man that's who he is that's the uh the new meme that we're starting all right though here we go we got a bunch of glasses and just you know dj toilets they're not hard to take out guys basically i like to consider these rounds like freebies yo toby loves the streams let's make sure we say thank you to him i appreciate that man i'm glad you like them I hope to uh, get you on my team during one of the streams again. I know you became a member at the end of the stream today. So, hey, at least I'm playing with you now, though. That's awesome that you're making it into the video. I told you during the stream, if you were on, I would invite you to the squad. And hey, look, it, you made it. So, that's great. That's great. I'm glad you're here. Now, another one of these. We got a police toilet round. Okay, so these aren't too bad. We might get a boss towards the end. I don't know if that's going to be a problem for us or not. It shouldn't be. So, large toilets, they're kind of like a waste. They're not too scary. We should be just fine. There we go. And any second now, boom, they're done for. One more round, and I think we're going to have some tanks, and that's going to be awesome. I'm guessing the tanks have 30k HP. If they have more than that, that would be even better. But like, imagine they got up to like 100k. I mean, realistically, the engineer cameraman should be one of the best units in the game because he's in the exclusive crate, and he's got a 1% like chance to actually get it. So that's super, super you know, rare. An app scammed you for $10 for an auto clicker. Oh, man, don't do any uh, paying for auto clickers, man. They're free usually, so be careful with that. All right, so we are maxed out now. We actually have it maxed out. That's awesome. Level six. Now, I could get another one down here pretty soon. That's going to be pretty cool. And then we're going to be getting even more guys down, which is just insane. 
So here we go. Let's get another one going. Boom. Nice, 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 nice. Look at There it is right there. And there is the tank. Yo, look at that. That is pretty cool. That is really, really cool. The, uh, the little small camera toy, it's okay. But the tank is actually awesome. Now, uh-oh, guys. We got a whole wave of bosses here. This is uh, kind of scary. They have 150k HP, so it's, it's a lot. But when our tank gets over here, we might be just fine. Unfortunately, the tank kind of drives a little slow. But at least the cooldown on it is not bad. Like, you can kind of tell the cooldown difference. So we place those at the same time. The tank's right here. And this is where that new unit that we got is. So you kind of can just tell, like, right away how much of a difference it makes when you start doing your little upgrades, right? Now, we got that one upgraded quite a bit. And LTI might cry, not gonna lie. I don't know what to say to that. I'm just gonna say LOL, laughing out loud. That's funny, Toby. Don't cry, man. Don't cry. Don't cry. Look, Parasite Tank. Yes, sir. We got it. Hopefully, it's, uh, it's gonna be good, though. I don't know. Does it actually shoot or does it just drive right into them? Oh, so it does shoot, but does it do that much damage? Well, it definitely tanks a lot there. When you when it gets run over, it does quite a bit. But I might focus on getting some more of these jetpack camera guys. I mean, it's still good to have them because, you know, they're only four units. And then a lot of the other guys are going to be the other ones. So, you know, just because I'm not going to have any Titans in this game, I'll just make sure I max out my engineer cameraman. And it'll be a good just like safety unit in the back. And then, yeah, yeah, we definitely need more of these uh, jetpack cameramen, guys. Don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. I know, I know. They're like the best unit in the game for sure, for sure. We might win, Toby. We might, we might. We might. Just focus jetpacks and we'll be good. We get one jetpack guy and one AOE guy. One AOE. We should be okay. All right. Let's see here. We got vacuum toilets. They got 300k HP. That is a very, very lot, but still not too, too worried. And also, these are pretty good for the tank because check that out. The tank kind of just sits there and can melt it. Yeah, that did like 30,000 damage. So anytime the tank gets like, like, you know, walks into the guy or, you know, drives into the guy, it does 30,000 damage. Plus these uh, like laser beam. I don't know how much the laser beam actually does. Let's see if we could like check the DPS. Does it do that? No, we don't really know. I don't know how much the DPS is, but all I know is it's doing good. It is doing very, very good so far. So let's just keep that going. Let's upgrade him again. And then we can upgrade him one more time after that. And then the next upgrade is like 4,000. So that's a lot, but we'll get it done. We'll get it done. I want it because then like every, what, 20 seconds, that's 60,000 damage. And, you know, having a few of those on the track, that's really good for us. Plus it like slows them down, I think a little bit. Engineer is OP, Toby. It seems pretty good. Oh, I like how it actually could reach over here. So that did like 3,000 damage pretty quickly. It's not bad. It's not bad. I think that the jetpack guys still might be better because they do more DPS. But it ain't bad. I wouldn't say OP, but they are, they're definitely useful. They're useful as just backup units. Jetpacks, though, they're OP. I'm just telling that. Jetpack, OP. Engineer, nice as backup. All right, though, let's uh, just keep this going. We might get that next upgrade pretty soon. That's a lot of extra DPS for us, actually, because if we can remove that, like, two-second cooldown to one second, that's humongous, humongous difference. There we go, guys. We got enough money, so let's get that upgrade going. And then we can soon enough get some more, you know, engineers down. Actually, I'll probably max this one out first, and then we can focus on getting some more. We just need $4,000, and then we will be have two tanks every single 20 seconds, so... That's 60,000 damage every 20 seconds. You know, not even though, because look at there's one, two, three on the track, four on the track. Yeah, four on the track all at once. So that's a lot of extra damage in case some of the guys are getting through and we'll be pretty safe. I'm just trying to get a stable scientist setup so I don't go bankrupt, boy. I feel that, man. I feel that. I would love to get some more going here, but I don't uh, think that's a good move right now. I should probably be focusing on getting some damage units out. Just in case things go pretty bad, we want to have some sort of DPS going. It's backup. Yeah, definitely backup. Definitely backup. You got Max Titan TV. Do we have Max Titan TV? I think, yeah, we do. Toby's got a Max Titan TV. Nice. I would probably prefer putting it like right here in the middle because then it could reach more this way, but not bad placement. It could reach most of the track. I would recommend, though, definitely getting it this way. That way, it's just more useful. But 
later on in the game he'll have more down probably won't matter too too much right guys now i just want to get like one more of my engineers now i can wait longer before i get cinnamon man yes you could yes you could well like i said i want to get some more engineer cameramen down just so like you know i can get more tanks going and have a lot more damage and then i'll probably focus on getting a lot more jetpack guys going that should be fine i think at least we'll see though We'll see. We got a lot of jetpack guys going right now the way it is. I think they're able to handle this. They're taking down a million troop right now. So if they're able to do that, they think that is a million, right? Let's see. Yeah, that's got a million. So that UFO just got taken out even though it has a million HP. Now our tank should be able to reach those guys. Yep, look at that. The tank is actually hitting those units. So that's really good. And as soon as we take out these toilets, the vacuum ones, we'll have enough to do our final upgrade on this engineer cameraman. And then I'll focus more on jetpack guys. And then we'll drop down two more tanks later on in the game when we max out our guys. And then I'll just start like deleting some of our scientists. So here we go though. And one more vacuum left. We could get this upgrade going. So now guys, we have two tanks. What do you say we upgrade some of our scientist cameramen because they're all level one. We might as well get some, you know, more use out of them rather than just letting them sit there and like not really do too much. We could get that good old extra hundred coins every single time or hundred dollars. And that'll be a lot, a lot better. Now, this next time, there should be two tanks that spawn. Next one should be a tank as well. So, this is humongous. Now, where is it? I don't know. Any second, it should spawn. What happened? Did I automatically delete it there? Or accidentally delete it? No, there it is. All right, guys. We got tanks on the map. Two at a time. Very, very useful. That's what I like to see. So, we just got an extra $2,000. Let's get some more upgrades going on our scientist cameraman. I think we got them all upgraded once. We can get them upgraded twice. There are two of them are level three. That'll be good. Medic would be useful. Yeah, we can get some medics going, guys, for sure. There we go. Medic down. And what is this? Oh, we got a medic there, too. Yeah, we definitely got to max out the medics as well because later on in the game, they could, uh, you know, be very, very crucial for us. So we'll get a double upgrade going on those. So that's really good. Now we got a boss toilet. It's got almost a million HP. Max Titan TV absolutely destroys the weaker enemies. Yeah. The max one's super, super good. I'm not sure what he said here. W placement? I missed that message there. I should have speed. I'm sorry. All right, though. We are getting a lot extra money here, so that's good. We could, uh, you know, one more round. Let's focus up on getting some of these scientist cameramen upgraded. I just need, like, $300. We'll upgrade this guy one more time, and I think we'll stop there with the upgrades on those guys, and then I'm just going to straight focus on doing more DPS because we already got the tanks going, so that's good. That's going to be, like, 60K every single time, so... That helps out quite a bit, so watch that. He's gonna get run over, and boom, big chunk of his health taken off right there. We got another million toilet, though, on the way, so that's not really that good. AoE, hopefully that AoE helps out a lot here. Now, that toilet, though, is at half HP. I think we'll be fine. Hopefully, we'll start getting some more focus going in on those flying rocket launcher toilets. That would be really nice. We good? Yeah, we should be good, guys. We should be good. That tank will finish it off. Yep, we're good. We're good. No worries. No worries. Now, did I get that other one upgraded? I did not. There we go. We don't need much more AoE. Yeah, I mean, honestly, more, like, DPS for a single target would be better. But it's still pretty good to have AoE. It helps out. Definitely does. More jetpacks, though. Let's just say that. More jetpacks is good. We'll just say that. I don't know. Hopefully, they get the point. I still got to place my jetpack guys down for sure. I only have one of them down. I'm going to get a lot more soon. It's just, uh, you know, we'll get some more. Don't place anything here yet. Yeah, bad idea. We don't need them there. Yeah, that's a better spot right there. That Titan TV man is going to be perfect. Uh-oh, Titan Cinnamon man. We got him. Yo, let's go. That's good. That's really good. Once we get him upgraded all the way, he does 3,000 damage every 0.2 seconds. Why your user red, LT? Why is my username red? in chat i don't know partner question mark i'm not sure actually i don't know i don't know i don't know if you mean like above my head or what i don't actually don't know so if you're watching this video i show speed i have no clue man all right though we can upgrade our jetpack guy one more time and boom there we go nice now we have so many tanks on the track look at this one two three four five six seven tanks so seven times thirty thousand that's almost like, what, 200k DPS any second? You know, that's good. Obviously, only single target kind of sucks, but hey, it's okay. I'll get agent at wave 45. Nice, the agent's going to be cool. 
Agent's really good to have on your team, guys. A little, like, it's always good to have a mix of units on your team. We need more DPS, though. Yep, absolutely, absolutely. I agree. I 1,000% agree with that. DPS is the way to go. Because these rocket toilets, they're sneaking up on us. That's for sure. There we go, though. We got another one of our jetpack guys down, so that's good. But that rocket toilet's going to die. Don't worry. We did good on dual bus side. Yes, we did, actually. We did very good on the dual bus side. But I'm going to start focusing on more jetpacks. We definitely need more jetpacks. Yep. Yep. That's what I'm doing now. So, I think I could get four tanks going at once, but it's definitely more important to have jetpacks down. We could get our tanks later on in the game, and that will be okay. Now, we have dual blade toilets. They're kind of scary. They got 500k HP. So, they're definitely something that AoE is really good for. Because they could attack all these guys at one time. I don't know why the large glasses guy is other than back. He's useless. He only has like 100k HP. He's no like worry at all. Look at that. Wow, we absolutely smoked that guy. And the tank did a little bit of extra damage for us. So, that's good. He also kind of, you know, does that single target like laser beam effect. So does this one right here, which is kind of nice. They kind of just like, they could stop and they could hit across, which is really, really good for the tanks. Yeah, like, look at that. See, like they do good amount of damage. Like not bad. Decent amount, right? It's not, it's not great by any means, but it's decent. Definitely decent. We just need 2,200 more dollars and we can get this next upgrade on our jetpack guy going. That's going to be good. So we'll get me like, what? I think 20,000 DPS at the time. So that's really good, actually. We just need to complete one more round here, and we'll have that going. Uh-oh, though, we got a UFO round going. Now, this is one of those waves where these AoE guys are going to be very useful to take out the spider toilets. Like, look at that. Oh, yeah. That's good. That's what we want. That's what we want, guys. Now, my uh, tank right there, he's targeting the toilets on, on accident. Gotta say that the anti-parasite tanks are well modeled. Yeah, they are well modeled. I agree. I definitely agree with that, for sure, 1,000%. What is on this guy's back? Is that a big hammer? That is. I'm more of spec there. Pretty cool. All right. This UFO unit is almost down here. Pretty close. Looks like our Titan Cinnamon Man is doing pretty good. When you upgrade him again, he loses damage. Well, that's weird, isn't it? I feel like that's pretty strange. Maybe he's actually not AoE yet. I don't think he is. Not yet. I think he's still single target. Yeah, he is just single target for the time being. Wow. So you do have to actually upgrade him twice there. Now, did I ever get my second upgrade on my other guy? I didn't. Now I did. All right, let's get another one of our jetpack guys going here. Like, we're just going to keep maxing these guys out, honestly, until uh, we can't anymore. And then once I get max troops, I'm going to delete two of my scientist uh, cameramen over here. That way, you know, at that point, we're not going to need more money. It's better to have more damage. And then we can get some more tanks going. Like, look at this. We have, like, four tanks right there, three. So that's like 90k damage right away. Let's just hope that we don't waste it on all these little guys right here because that would be unfortunate. Only if we could tell them to like stop, that would be pretty cool. I don't think you could do that though, <laughs> unfortunately. They could do this though, so that's nice. Wow, they are melting some of those guys though. Look at that. That one guy in the end there, it's only like 3,000 damage that he did, but hey, that's still pretty good if you ask me. Now this other unit is going to catch up, so that's like four. That might just kill that rocket toilet like right away. It did. It took out like half his HP, so... Really good, the tanks are for that. They're like a, a mini secret agent, kind of. That's the way I see it. Now, we are going to have another one of our guys fully upgraded here pretty soon, I think. If I could figure out which one he is, he's this one right here. Now, after this wave, we might get another $1,000 and be able to do it. Yep, we should. And, yep, there we go. All right, now I got, like, four guys doing 40k damage every second, so that's really good. Plus, all of our tanks going. Is beating to HQ in 38 minutes good? Yeah, I think that's good. Yes, very good, very good time. Is there a- Oh, there is a timer on the top right. I never even noticed that. So we've been playing this one for 25 minutes now. So that's a lot. Usually takes 50 minutes. So we're like halfway there. Halfway there, guys. Wave 30, so... Kind of makes sense, right? I still don't know if we're going to win or not. But I have good faith in this team. It seems like we all know what we're doing. So that's what I like to see from the boys. Or girls and there we go we got another one down and boom let's upgrade that one too all right we just need 1500 nice we got another upgrade on them so we're getting the work in right now we got some laser cameraman car going here that's pretty interesting toby people don't know, normally use those anymore that's pretty cool I like, I like seeing them they're actually one of my favorite units like look at how much damage they do it's only a legendary too it's the only have to like pay for them so they're good they're really good honestly nice we need like two x jetpacks if we want to win 
Let's go for that goal or something. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely, Morph. We need a lot more. A lot more. 1,000%. Give me a second. You're farming, boy. Keep on farming, man. Do your thing. Do your thing. Because we have a cinnamon man down. That's really good. We just need him upgraded a little bit more. So he's got some better, like, range. And, you know, of course, better range is always the best way. Now, our, like, AoE guys are doing a lot of good work for us, too, though. Like, look at how much damage some of those other units are taking. That's good. That one's got 3 million health. So that's obviously a little scary. But some of our jetpack guys are probably going to be able to, like, finish him up pretty soon here. There we go. We got about six jetpack ones down, so that's good. And in all together, I would say we have like 10 or more, 10 to 15 in total. So 150k damage per second, I would say, if you ask me, that's pretty good. Let's go ahead, though, and get our medic cameraman upgraded. Because by doing that... Oh, nice. Someone has one upgraded, too. That's going to remove our stuns very, very well. And that's going to be super useful for the team. Then also, I have this guy over here. He can remove the Titan stun. So that's good for us. Wow, look at us, though. We are absolutely wrecking these uh, rocket toilets. Run wave 31. Wow. That's good. That's good. Now, let's see. What's my video going to be about? It's going to be a se secret until you uh, actually see it. All right. These boss toilets, they got 1.1 million HP. That's a lot, but I think with all of our really, really strong units here, we should just mow them down. Oh, yeah, look at that. Basically, like, 300k damage per second there. Let's see, Engineer really isn't worth the trouble to get it. I would say, I would agree. Nah, it's not. You're right. Honestly, it's, like, it's good, but would, you, would I recommend spending all that uh, Robux on getting them? Probably not. Just get the jetpack. Jetpack way better. Honestly, considering, yeah, for 1%, tank lasers are, yeah, tank lasers need to be buffed. Lasers definitely need buff. I'll, I'll tell you that right now. They probably don't even know that because not many people that, like, even have it. Like, 4,000 people have it. Jetpack is way better. If you're going to buy anything, guys, just buy your jetpack and you could be any uh, difficult map. So, jetpack, way better. I'll suggest it to, to Lantric for sure. I'll let them know that the tanks need a huge buff. I would say it's a 50k HP and better lasers. And then they're uh, worth way more. Definitely going to mention that to them. I'll make a video uh, pointing that out as soon as this one comes out or something, okay? I'll let them know. I'll let them know. I'll send them like a, a Discord message or text or whatever. I got you guys. I got you guys. I agree though, 1000%. Like, I'm glad I have them, no doubt, because it's a rare unit. And they might be gone forever once like the new crate comes out. So that's pretty cool. But they absolutely need a buff because I would rather have jetpacks, to be honest with you. Now, later on in the game, they're still nice to have, but still, like, just get these down and you're safe. Basically, every single time, they just do so much more DPS. I will get the ones down later, two more later on, okay? Not yet, though. Let me just focus on getting these guys down. I want, as soon as I max out my troops, I will get more out, I promise you guys, okay? That way, we'll have four tanks all at once. It's going to be good. I just think that they should be better still. All right, though. We can get that upgraded. It looks like we got vacuums. Uh oh, this is like a boss wave. I still think we're going to be okay. So many spider toilets. Yeah, there's a lot of spider toilets, guys. But we should be able to take them out. No problem. Rocket toilets are going down quick. Now we got vacuums. The vacuums aren't scary. They only have like half a mil HP. So that's not too good. Plus, with all of our AoE damage guys, like they're almost all dead already. Like, look at that. Oh, yeah. Nice. Very, very good job, guys. So just mirror that tank just disappear. Yeah, they, they disappear, guys. They disappear. Now, let's see here. Wow, a lot of you guys actually have your scientist cameraman upgraded all the way. Is that the move? Should I be doing that? Like, I, I feel like I should, but I always get worried that, like, I mean, maybe if I sell two and then upgrade the other ones, max cinnamon man this wave, absolutely should for sure. Oh, this one unit doesn't look like he has enough range. Yeah, he wasn't fully upgraded. There we go. Now he's upgraded. Now I just need two or 3,000 more, and then I could get the max upgrade on him, and that'll be pretty good. I really hope I could win with these guys for this video because I don't I don't think I have a video on my channel yet where I won with a group. So for those of you guys still watching like this far into the game, you can kind of use this as like a little tutorial, a little guide on how to beat this with like a group of players. Basically... A few key things. Make a group of your units down here. All right. Group your units up like this. Your scientist guys. 
Medics, not your medics should be back here, but like your science cameramen should be up in the front. In this row right here, it would be ideal to have mechs where I'm running right now. In this row right here, if you could get cinnamon man or cameraman, that would be great. And then back here in this square area, mainly like next to the sandbag, you guys should definitely get your jetpack guys right here, okay? By doing that, you're gonna win every single game. Now, if you have the engineer guy like me, I would place him down at the end or in the, like in the beginning is good too, definitely. Like for you as your first unit, that's a pretty good idea. But later on in the game, like after you get one or two of them down, focus your jetpack guys. And then at the end, when you have to start deleting for more units, you can max out all of your engineers. And that's just gonna be good for that extra like, you know, 30K DPS every time he runs into a troop. It's kind of nice. It's like, watch, boom, nice little spike right there. Kind of just does a little nice work. Plus those lasers, it's not bad. Still not great. I think it really needs a buff just for being how rare it is. I'm just, I'm happy I got it though. I'm not going to complain. I got it. And one day it'll probably be unobtainable anymore. So I'll, you know, it'll be worth a lot of uh, coins or whatever the trading system is going to be in this game at some point. So that's pretty cool. I'm happy about that. Thank you guys for sending me crates. I appreciate it. Honestly, though, guys, you don't need to send me any more because I already have all the units now. So shout out to you guys for sending me a lot of crates. If you, you know, wanted to send me more in the future when like a new crate comes out, hey, I'll gladly take him. I hope that we can get some more, but you don't have to for right now. No point. Unless uh, in the future, I'll be able to like, you know, use them for more giveaways and stuff. So that'd be cool. But that's what I'm going to do with the rest of them. Why open them up for myself right now? I just feel like that's pointless when I could kind of like give them away in the future to you guys. That just seems like a little bit better of an idea. So I hope you guys appreciate that. We'll uh, be sure to get some of you guys some of those as soon as possible, as soon as we're able to. Like obviously right now, physically can't because trading is sadly not in the game. But one day I know it will be because they actually told me it will be. So that's gonna be cool, pretty exciting. Now we almost have enough to upgrade this guy too. Let's go. We just need uh, what, $300? Nice, there we go guys, let's go. Another fully upgraded guy. And we should be maxing out our like unit range here. So that's gonna be pretty close. I don't know when exactly, but maybe one more. Let's see, can we even place one more? I don't know. You have too many troops, sell one first. All right, guys, so we're at max. So let's find our scientist cameraman. There's one. And we can get down another engineer. Let's do it. There we go. Just for funsies. All right, let's upgrade him. And upgrade him again, nice. What's up, Toby? You said my name. Let's just see. Sup? Question mark. Hopefully, we have enough AOE. LT still never maxed that medic. Uh oh. I'll max it. Don't you worry. We'll get a max. We'll get a max. No worries, guys. No worries. I got it. I got it. I thought I actually did max it. That's on me. That's on me. We'll get it. We'll get it. We need uh, 2,000 more dollars and then we could actually max it out, okay? So, real soon. Real soon. You're not max medic? Yep. I will. I will. Got you. Next, I will. For sure, for sure. We just need a little bit more money, and then we can do that. I think this is max. Yep, this should be max right after this. All right, after this round, one more kill. One more. Boom, there we go. Max the medic. And then I got another medic right here that I need to max too, so $4,000. And then we can get that one maxed, and then, like all these guys will be safe as well. Like, including the uh, cinnamon man and these ones over here. That's good. The AOE damage is perfect. So, like, seriously, guys... If you're playing this and you're struggling, don't use any other Titans other than the Titan TV Man and the Sinman Man, and you'll be okay. The other ones are just a waste of space. You're gonna be better off with Jetpack guys, medics on your team, mechs to slow units down, and make sure you have your camera guys for extra money. And then like the tanks, they're like a cool vanity uh, troop, right? I kind of like having them because they're cool to have on your team, but I am definitely gonna talk to Talantric about this, and I hope that he agrees with me. They're just not good enough. For how rare they are, the uh, the damage needs to be better and their health needs to be better, I think. Even if... No, they shouldn't even cost more. Honestly, it should just go up to 50k HP or something, in my opinion. Because, like, yeah, look at that, guys. It doesn't do too, too much damage, to be honest with you. Like, it's nice. Like I said, I'm going to keep on saying that. It is nice to have them. I, I'm glad I got it. I'm not going to complain about that at all. I was lucky enough to get them. So that's really, really awesome. I just think of the future... You know, it should be upgraded a little bit. Especially because the game is going to get harder and harder. So, like, it needs to be way better. And it's the first ever crate in the game. So, like, 
a year from now, if this game's still popular, then it should be like one of the best units in the entire game. So we just got to hope for that and we'll see it in the future. Not sure how long this game is going to be popular for, but I surely hope that it exists for a very, very long time because that'd be really awesome for everyone who's like doing YouTube on it now and for Talantric, of course, as well. Boy, yeah, you guys maxed out those Cinnamon Man pretty well, so that's good. I am very glad to see that. I will get down another tank guy pretty soon. That thing outside of the triangle, I'm not sure what you mean. I mean box. For sure, for sure. All right, though, we got a bunch of UFO guys attacking us now. We should be okay, but they scare me a little bit because they actually have a lot. Put the laser cameraman here. I don't have him, man. I don't have him. I took him off my uh, team for the uh, other guys, unfortunately. It's all right, though. It's all right. Yeah, these guys over here, though, the laser camera and car should be placed forward more, I think. But that's okay, Toby. I think they're fine where they are. It'll survive. It'll survive. Let's get another upgrade going on these guys. Another one. And boom. Nice. And then we should have 2,000 to upgrade this one, too. Sweet. So now we're going to be getting, like, an extra 1,000. 1,200. That's pretty darn good, if you ask me. And then soon enough, we'll actually... We can actually just delete that guy right now. Place down another engineer cameraman. He'll go right there, and we'll start upgrading him all the way. We just need $2,000. We get him fully maxed out, and then all of our other units are going to be jetpack cameramen. So that's going to be pretty soon here, actually. We can get this guy upgraded right after this round. Getting one more max cinnamon man than just completely focusing on jetpacks. I agree. That's a good idea. Very, very good idea. Now we got that guy all the way down, and then we can focus on getting some more of our other units down here pretty soon as well. All right. Let's see, though. Let's see. This flamethrower toilet's actually uh, kind of doing a lot of work on us. Well, <laughs> take that back. No, he's not. He didn't get anywhere. We smoked him. Look at all of our jetpacks, guys. This is insane. That's a lot of jetpacks. That's cool. That's cool. We got a lot of AoE, a lot of jetpacks. Looking good. Looking really good. And how's this medic? Yeah, he's doing good. Yeah, I think that you guys know what you're doing, so we should be fine here. I think we win this every single time now because... I basically broke it. We now know how to beat it every map, every time. Jetpacks all the way. That's all you gotta use. It'd be fun to mix it up, but like it's unwinnable when you mix up your guys. Like you have to have the jetpacks. And it sucks because it's a pay to win unit. It really sucks. I feel like the jetpack should have been the 1% unit. That would have been really cool. You get so much money from the kills now. Yeah, you do get a lot of money from the, uh, you know, just taking out troops right now. That's, that's a fact. All right, though, we could basically wait one more round and then we'll get two extra jetpack guys down. That's going to be 20,000 extra DPS. So pretty good. Pretty good for us there. Not going to lie. We'll just toss those down over here somewhere, maybe even right here just to help out. And that'll be really good for us. So that should be enough. We'll sell that guy. Get down another unit right about here. And let's get him upgraded. Nice. All right. So we only are going to have one more left, like one more guy that we could place, but that's okay. That's good to have this all maxed out, though, before wave like 45. I'm pretty proud of that. Solid. Very solid. Look at these tanks. We got double tanks coming in here. Nice. They're going to get uh, taken out pretty quick, but hey, they like stop them for like maybe a split second. And then they, when they get run over, they do that 30,000 extra damage. So like I said, it's like a, a mini secret agent kind of. That's the way I see it. Now, we'll wait one more round here, and then we'll get the next one out. By the way, it looks as if when these guys get stunned, it doesn't really matter. So definitely place your engineer guys in the front if you have them, just because why not? It's a free stun, free tank, free tank. So do it every time, do it every time, guys. Now, we got a lot of turret spider toilets. These ones are annoying. They have a lot of HP, and there's a lot of them. But because of our AoE guys... We're going to be just fine. We're going to be just fine. And I'm glad as of this far into the game, no one actually got kicked from the match. Sometimes people get kicked from the match and that kind of stinks. But so far, they're all here. So that's good. That is good. Yo, whoever's got the scientist cameraman, let me just tell him. Someone has four scientist cams. Delete and go for more DPS, please. Hopefully they get the message. I'm not sure who it is. But someone's got four of them down. We don't really need them anymore. So let's just hope that uh, they delete them and put down a better unit, right? Now, let's get one of these guys down right there. We'll fully max them out. And now I am done. I am fully maxed out. I can't do anything else. So I'm not sure who this is over here, though. Pineapple. 
Let's see if I message pineapple. I will just give me a second. Okay. It's pineapple. He's going for the max cinnamon man guy. Got you. I got you. Go for it. Uh oh, guys. We got a toilet. Toxic skull toilet. This is my favorite boss in the game. If you guys are still watching this far into the video, what's your favorite boss? Let me know in the comments. I'm just curious. It's, uh, I think it's the coolest looking and it's got like that, like the green, like, I don't know, what's that effect, like particle effect? Pretty cool. All right, though, here we go in round 44, wave 44. And look at this, our tanks are gonna stack right here. Look at them stacking. Oh, they can't even do anything right now. The glass is still, it's round so easy. Wave 44 is a joke. We could do this with our eyes closed, guys. If we beat wave 45, we win all waves. After that one, our, I, stop running away. Get back here. Get back here. Our easier? Okay, nice. Wave 45 is the hardest, I guess, guys. I didn't know that. Look at how many, I know, we have so many. Look at all the tanks, guys. The tanks are unreal. The tanks are gonna one-shot something. Seriously. This is insane. Uh-oh, flamethrower toilet time. Can we take it out, though? I mean, absolutely, I think we could. We only have three of them and then a boss to deal with here. That's a little scary, but I think we'll be good. We'll be good here. Let's see. Flamethrower toilet. All the jetpacks attacking will be like 350k damage per second. I know, right? Basically, that's what it is. That's so much damage. Watch this. I uh, didn't even do that much. There was so many. Yeah, guys, I'm going to be honest with you. I hate to be a, a Debbie Downer here, but the tank kind of sucks. <laughs> it does. The tank kind of sucks. Sad to say. Tank kind of sucks. I'm going to just let him know. Be honest with you. I need to tell him. I need to tell him. I need to tell him for real, for real. Absolutely. I hope they agree with me. So on single, it acts better, obviously. In single player, maybe. Maybe. I don't know. I never tried it in single player. This is my first match with it. So maybe in single player, it is actually better. But even right now, it's... Like, it's not that much. He said he's nerfing it. He's nerfing it. The tank? No way. You can't nerf it. Just sell the tanks to get more jetpacks, honestly. I want to keep using them just because it's for the video's sake. But if I have to later on, I'll be sure to delete them first, okay? I kind of wish I had more, like, Titan guys down, to be honest with you. That would be uh, way better off. That would be way better off. This is the hardest wave, to be honest. Yeah, here we go. Let's see if we can beat it. I think we should be okay. But we'll see here pretty soon. Uh-oh. Some of the UFOs are getting kind of far. But look at the vacuums, guys. The vacuums are getting taken out by the AOE, guys. Let's go. This is harder than the last five waves. If we win, we'll win. Nice. I think, yeah, we got it, guys. We're good. GG's in the chat. We are winners. It's just because of this uh, jetpack spam. That's all you got to do. All you got to do, guys, spam jetpacks. You'll win every single time. Tanks are cool now for like a vanity item, but they're just not good. If he's nerfing them, then don't even buy crates, guys. There's no point because they're just not good. Don't buy crates. There's no point. No point. Uh-oh. We have an infected Titan speaker, man. Uh-oh. That's big trouble. Big trouble. Can we take him out? I sure hope so. He's kind of moving. He's cruising. He is cruising, guys. We got to take out all these dual blade toilets. Luckily, we're getting that AOE damage in here. They're all at like half HP already, so that's really good. Once they uh, start running into these uh, cinnamon man back here, it's going to be a wrap for all those guys. The helicopter guys are kind of scary too, to be honest with you. Wow, though. The uh, infected guy just got deleted. Like, straight up deleted. How do you even lose to him? He's such an easy enemy to the speaker man. I don't know. Oh, look at this too. We got a, a secret agent over here. He does 200,000 damage every single time he attacks. Sadly, his uh, cooldown is 30 seconds. But still, that's pretty good for like later on i'm the owner i have a wall that can't get past that happened in one of my last uh, streams remember that that's pretty funny it says deleted titan spearman i'm not sure why it says that that's weird all right though look at our aoe guys we're just kind of taking out all of these uh assassin toilets like instantly and we got some more guys maxed out over here as well titan tv man jacob nice man good stuff good stuff they're actually not maxed out just yet but they will be pretty soon and by the way guys we're on wave 47 so we're making pretty good timing here we're only 45 minutes in about like 50 minutes in. that's basically when you win every single time so pretty close shouldn't be tanks be able to save him i hope so we'll see all right though we got two or three boss 3.0 toilets inbound here that's a little bit scary but not too too bad 
we should be just fine and they're getting deleted too they eventually get up to like 5 million hp but when you have this many jetpack guys attacking 5 million hp is like no hp at all they might as well not attack us they might as well just sit in that tunnel and not even come out because they're useless they are gonna get smoked right away now we got some more turret spider toilets these ones are scary they got 2 million hp and there's just a lot of them that's why i don't really like to deal with those whenever i play solo if i ever lose it's usually to those turret spider toilets every single time or these helicopter guys the helicopter guys mess me up a lot they got smoked though in episode 57 part 2 did you guys see that they got taken out pretty quick i think he got like his head squished or something right or was that the boss it was one of them it's pretty cool though all right though the aoe is making good work of these dual blade toilets they're gonna be done here pretty soon and then the flying rockets and more helicopter guys they gotta get taken out here pretty quickly too otherwise we're gonna lose but i think we'll be okay and look at all this work happening oh yeah we're fine they're all about to die instantly to the aoe and the helicopters are too busy stunning my medics are taking good care of that no problem at all they're just gonna get unstunned immediately and then boom deleted all right guys good luck I think wave 48. No, someone just left. Someone just left. Boy just left. Oh, he joined back. Okay. Wow, that, that actually scared me for a second. He scared me for a second there, man. Scared me for a second there. That would have been so bad if he left. I'm not sure if it, like, removes the health at all. We lost so many guys, lol. No, he's back. He's back. Scared me there for a second, though. Yeah, we lost so many when he left like that. Jeez, all these, like, titans were deleted and stuff. We definitely would have lost, I think. All right, though, this is wave 49, guys, and this wave seems pretty easy, too. They're just not getting far at all. And, like, the toxic toilet moves so slow. He's no problem. The infected titan speaker man, though, he kind of cruises. But once he dies, flamethrower moves slow. Then the toilet moves slow, too. So we're chilling. We're good, we're good. And let's delete the toilet. Three, two, one, and GG's. Next round, guys, we're going to have to deal with the glitch. These two are trying to friend each other. All right, cool stuff, cool stuff. Get that max uh, coin there. And uh, good job, guys. Enjoy your free crates when we win this. All right? GG's, guys. GG. All right, though. Now we got the final wave. Let's see. Three friends is the max, by the way. The last wave. Yep, last wave. We got all the hard units coming after us now. We should be okay. For some reason, we're not. That would be really sad, but I think we'll be good. I'm scared about that glitch toilet, though. He He's, like, weird. He, like, drives off the track, and he kind of... You know, it sketches me out sometimes. What is that right there? I don't know. Oh, there he is. Glitch toilet. 4 million HP. He moves. He is moving, guys. Whoa. Where did he go? There he is. Get back on the track, you cheater. Get back on the track. Now he's cheating in my lobbies right now, right? What is that all about? How we doing, though? Infected Titan Man's dead. Boss 3.0 is about to die. And then that's about it, guys. That is about it. Toxic School Toilet's got a lot of HP, but we'll get him next, right? No worries, guys. No worries. GG's in the chat for this one. GG's in the comment if you made it this far, all right? Let's see some GG's for all these guys. The uh, Glitch Toilet's still too worried about driving off the track. He's going to get smoked. You're absolutely right. I'm not sure what you said there, boy. But hey, guys. Good game. Good game. We actually won again. Let's go. I feel like I can't lose anymore. We just know how to win every single time now. So now it's like super, super easy. So I love to see that. It's a good feeling. All right. Good game, guys. Enjoy those crates. All right. GG's in the chat. Put it in the comments too, guys. Such an easy game. Trash toilets. You're right, boy. They're trash. Not better than us anymore. That's good, though. We got uh, 1,500 coins there. And now we are at 20,000 for the update whenever it comes out pretty soon, I think. All right, though, guys. If you're still watching this far in the video and you haven't liked yet, what are you waiting for? You clearly like the video, so smash that like button until you break it. Also, if you're not subscribed yet, make sure you smash that subscribe button so we can do another awesome giveaway for you guys pretty soon here. And lastly, if you want to watch another video from me, check out the one on your screen right now where I teach you guys how to solo the Toilet HQ. It's going to be a good video. It's going to teach you a lot of good stuff that you need to know, kind of troops to bring, where to place them, all that great stuff. So I'll see you on over there. Adios.